<laughs> on that previous episode, we got some good loot. Not too bad. Chat, we got the North Blade. Uh, we'll get to that in just a second. So, new Rough Rider, we got that. New B Shield. We got the 880 Antagonist. 11 runs, by the way. A uh, new Peak Opener for shredding the game. Top Nia from Top Nia Chest again. Swell Powder is actually really, really good still. We're still using that. Flying Sandhawk, we got that on the first run. Like, what was it, like 55 rerolls or something? Not too bad. North Fleet from Hyperius, really cool find. And a Bone Shredder for Reflect Killing. Here's the build. Or actually, no, this is not the build. This is um Hyperius Killing build. So don't follow that. That's not, you know, something you need to know. And yeah, chat, off you go. Let's do it. Let me get my loot first, though. Let's not leave it on the floor. All right, all right, all right. Let's address the elephant in the room. And yeah, let's address the other elephant in the room. I saw the comments, guys. You guys told me. Bring it up. Leslie said, yo, that kill at 1930 dropped a legendary lol. Dude, even with the drop mod, I still am missing legendaries. I am so bad. Okay, so we killed the dude in the arena, right? Right here. Watch. Watch the mini-map. You ready for this? We shoot up. He dies. Right there. There's a legendary. And I missed it. I freaking missed right, it, dude. Yeah, I'm terrible. <laughs> so yeah, I want to get one more Nora Plate. If we don't get a good one, it's fine. Not a big deal. But I just want to see if we can get ourselves a um a nice corrosive one for the peak. Uh, by the way, I tried fighting Giant Hyperius off stream to see if I could like actually do it. Dude, there's something weird with this hitbox. Like it just will not reflect back right. I think it's like reflecting upwards and like missing him somehow or something. I don't know. But reflection kills aren't working on him for some odd reason, and I don't know why. Time to go insane. Dude! Just like that, easy. That was the first go at it too, what the heck? All right, what do we got here? We have a Whiskey Tango, we don't need that. Sledges, eh. Um, I'm not seeing a Norfleet though. Dude, I honestly think the Norfleet might be a lower drop chance for the mod. Like, it still drops commonly, but compared to all the other items, maybe it's a lower chance. Cause we're finding everything for his dedicated, ooh. But, um, not the Norfleet. Kinda interesting, what is that? Oh, it's a peek into the void. You're not supposed to see that. Is that a quad? Not a matching grip, though, but that's okay. All right, try again. Run number two. Yeah, we're probably going to hit max level today, too. We capped ourselves out at 72 for the mod. You can choose 72 or 80. I chose 72 because 80 offers way too many skill points. Like, you can literally spec every build into one character build. And I'm not a huge fan of that. Also, I don't like OP10, so I'd prefer to do something like OP8. Ooh, so close. Ooh, the chunkage. Is that... Ooh, that might be rage mode. I could chunk at him until he dies, Chad. Yeah, you sit down, sir. Uh, I don't feel comfortable with this HP. Oh. You know, I could use that quad on the ground for a reply kill. Should we just, like, pick that up and try it? All right, let me try the quad. Oh. Oh. Gunner Ring, I don't think he drops that. That's uh, Master Gi, so yeah, we'll drop. Kind of cool. <gasps> 34, yo, let me get that. All right, let me try again. Okay, all right, that is three. Oh, it's Slag though, but it has matching grip. Oh man. Yeah, Slag, matching grip, nor plate. Uh, fire rate prefix too. Oh, also no rocket speed either. Dude, it is so bright over here, my eyes. I'm like looking at the sun. I think we randomized Giant Sun. Okay, not bad, not bad. We got a little uh, pinch there. I have a few skill points. Nah. -uh. I thought 33 in that corner was like my level. What are you talking about? Hey, there we go. Oh, Pyrophobia. No. <laughs> Dude, it's even damage prefix and Torg exhaust. That would have been a really good Norfleet if it would have rolled a Norfleet. Man. Yeah, last kill, guys, for real. We got to move on. Oh, dude, I'm so glad I sat that one out. I'm like, you know, thinking, holy frames right now. Not seeing a Norfleet. Is that a B-Shield? Yo. It might be Malawan top. I could be Torgor Malawan. Let's see. <gasps> Malawan. Dude, that's a really good B-Shield. I mean, we got a shock Norfleet. That's not, like, terrible. Actually, we need three levels. Hmm. We could just go blood explode the, uh, the rabbits for a little bit. Maybe get some tubbies, too. It doesn't really matter where I put the points. All I need is, um, release the beast and blood explosion and fuel to blood. And then, yeah, we'll put on our legendary sickle. For UVHM, we haven't really farmed XP at all. 
And we're only three levels away from max level. Isn't that cool? No more like five hour XP grind to level 80 or 72, you know? If you ever get a BL2 remastered, they need to triple the XP values for uh, for UVHM. It would make a huge difference. With a double rabbit. Bruh. 41,000. There's another rabbit. We just got like over two bars of XP. And that one run. <laughs> Let's go to bunker and do the uh, the fun kill. And yeah, we're gonna grab our pull the pin double XP if you get a kill, right? With a grenade. New build for bunker farming. Yeah, we're farming bunker, guys. If you get the 94 sham, I will be very sad, all right? I hope you don't get it. I kind of hope you get it. I don't know, man. All right, here we go. The skip dude. Beautiful. I don't have like any ammo left. Dude, Norfleet should not exist, for real. If you get the 94 sham, it doesn't count for our 94 sham. Because keep in mind, we're running a mod, so it doesn't really count as a legit drop if we get it. That wasn't bad. <laughs> and now what we got to do is put on the skyrocket, right? We're going to down ourselves, right? Okay. Bunker's right there, right? We're going to bleed out. And a skyrocket's going to shoot straight up and get a second wind. See that? 134,000 XP because of pull the pen. Yeah. We're almost a level up already. Isn't that insane? I'm pretty sure he can double drop too, like Hyperius and whatnot. So we could drop the Fatal and the Sham on the same kill. All right, try it again. Oh, we could spawn right there. Look at that. A little bit faster. Level up. I didn't see the XP value. Dude, that's like a whole like one third level in one run. Could it work for the warrior? No, warrior doesn't work. You don't get the XP until the moonshot happens and the moonshot's not you killing them, sadly. Oh, we got a head drop and a sham. Yo, double drop. So that head drop is 150, 25 point head drop. And a, aw, one off the worst sham, guys. Dang it. 78. Beautiful. All right, go. If we pause and unpause, we can see our XP value. Dude, that's so dumb. <laughs> oh, another sham. Dude, back to back shams. Okay, you're the same one. Wow, just different part placement. Huh. Interesting. Oh, and a volcano. Uh. Huh? <laughs> Chat, what is happening? This is a new one. Dude, I've seen a lot of broken bunker kills, but this is, this is beyond bizarre. <laughs> um, I think he still like is programmed to be alive, but he's dead at the same time. What? And then he... Do I get like double loot drops or something? It looks like we only got one set of drops though. Okay, another sham. And a fatale. Huh. What do we got? That is a TDR, TDR, blind off two grade, which is going to be 81%? Yeah. Not bad. And that. Very, very cool. No! Also, level up, dude. Didn't say it. My bad. One more. We are just about there. Dude, Raven Retribution Gloves. Fascistic, sadistic, pistic. Let the bullets scrape me clean. And never, ever, ever flash a Dude, he's so angry. <laughs> oh, wall. Oh my goodness, look at my XP. Are you kidding me? <laughs> uh, we're like a pinch of XP away. You know what? That settles it. We're going for one more kill. Oh, level up. Oh, I wasn't ready for that. I wanted a bunker level up. All right, max level, 72. No drop. Oh, well. It is time. New name. Let's go. Yeah, let's do that. That's something different. King of Meat. Yeah, let's go ahead and gear up, guys. So let's go snag ourselves a quick peek opener. Hey, and then... There you go. That is your boss. Come on, first try. Yo, just like that. Look at that. Not matching grip, though. That's okay. 72. I'll take it. Easy mode. I mean, I could take an easy mode. Oh, new Rough Rider. Yeah, let me get that first, too. This is our final 72 build. Boom. This should work. He died. Look at that. Another first try. So, I think it might be guaranteed now for UVHM. Uh, normally, it's a 1 in 3, but I feel like it's just way more common now. And it's got to be on level, right? Uh, Hyperion, Tidor, Tidor. Not bad. 
72. Look at that. Awesome. Well, bouncing body. Huh. We don't need that. Stormfront. Dude, if we get a longbow Stormfront, that'd be insane. We don't super need that, but it would be cool. Oh! Hmm. Why not? Just, just why not? <laughs> really, game? Really? You're gonna give me a longbow Zero Fuse Stormfront before a normal Tesla. Okay. Alrighty. More Assault Rifle Ammo. Because we're definitely gonna need it. Hope you're doing alright. I'm doing really good today, man. Not too bad. Sledge's wife! <gasps> Yo, there it is. We got it. It's right there. Dude, three runs. And we already got the uh, the one we're looking for. Sniper. Yeah, there we are. Thank you. Thank you, game. Real quick, let's get a random herald from a vendor. Like, Deepa isn't bad, but for Krieg, you get more DPS out of um a harder intense herald. With Bloodbath. Okay. There it is. Bro, that was <laughs> that was forever. Ah, uh, we got it. Cool. And it has Malawan sight. My favorite. We're done. Chat, I think we're ready for the peak. This is our basic setup. So Harold, Grog. Uh, we have Peak Opener, we have a Norplate, which we don't really need. We could do like Tapia. Uh Rough Rider, Stormfront for stacking, you know, healing if I need it. We have that for the assault rifle ammo. Reaper, here's the build. And yeah, chat. Let's do the peak. Four signs. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. I was about to say, you better heal me, Tannis. My goodness. Wait, she stopped. Tannis, you can't just stop partway through? Tannis! Oh my goodness, really? <laughs> the mod might not be perfect, but yeah, I'm sure it'll get fixed. Uh, Tannis, wow. All right, here we go. Dude, we are so overgeared for the peak. This peak is going to be so easy. There's a rabbit. You get the Norfleet. Cool. For real, no joke, who actually likes the peak? I am a fan of the peak. I know it's very long and grindy, but I love the challenge. I really do. Look at this swap speed. The droppable Grog. Yeah, I saw that is an option for the mod. Grog nozzle mission reward. Apparently it's on, but I'm not really going for that. Because if I do the mission and turn it in, I think the Grog right now would be like level 50 something, and it would do less damage per shot. I love that when you can swap away and like swap back for resetting your fire rate. Ow, my ears, dude. I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> yeah, you know what? We'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. Uh, we're good. Whew. You know what? I never take the onions. Why not? The switches for the peak now? They're free. They don't charge you for your reward for getting that far. Dude, I don't get why they ever added Radium to pull it. So for Reef, get one of these out so it doesn't throw axes at you. It'll block them, see? Kind of nice. Yeah, I think I'm going to North you. Cool. <laughs> and there it is. OP1, easy lay peasy. We can speed run through it. Whoa! <gasps> He's massive! Dude, I thought Scorch was like a big boy, but like, holy crap, look at this guy. You're dead too. Rip. We got a Anarchist. Hey, look at that. That'd be nice for Gage. We have Scorch. We had Scorch. Past tense. Bye. Nice knowing ya. Actually, I never knew ya. What am I talking about? Who's this guy? Yeah, right here. That's like very visible. And it goes through all the way down here. Oh, yeah, you definitely see it over here. <laughs> what do you mean? Why did I push that? I'm dumb. No. Oh, no. Uh, that was a double fight for your life. I should probably be a little more careful. Can I get slag? Thank you. That really is my fault. Again, this run's not about getting OPA, taking on all the raid bosses, stuff like that. In fact, going to OPA doesn't really offer anything new with the mod. I don't think there's much else I really need to show off for the mod, is there? Besides, like, binary boss. The caravan chest can apparently be a red chest, too, sometimes. So far, so good. We gotta get that kill skill from the top half. Yeah, that's working. We're fine. Hey, we got him. Beautiful. Alright, let's see that loot, man. Yeah, he definitely buffed it. It's better, for sure. I see one pearl. And then, yeah, Fable Tortoise. OP6. Uh, anything else? Oh, Flacker. What? Oh, wait, we got four legendaries. Never mind. 
so I say we go get that conference call, take on Crawl, and see what he's all about, and then um probably wrap up the playthrough. Again, not a whole lot more to do today. Okay, I'm seeing legendaries. Wait, what? Okay, not quite. Game. We're done. You know, I actually thought we didn't get it. I was like, game, really? <laughs> Dude, even matching grip, it's bladed though, but that's fine. I'm okay with that. How to kill Jack. Let me know. I'm down. Okay, hold on. Can I? There we go. Done. You okay? Did you hurt your arm? Aw. Wombum Island. Can you get crushed by the door? No. I thought you could. Maybe not. Look at this water. I can legit, like, hide under the water here. It is that deep. <laughs> Weird. Boom. Now we get our kill skill. Okay, good. Oh, I never swapped over to Reaper. Whatever, it's fine. No! <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Oh, no. I thought Creek had reduced knockback. Wait a minute. Kill skill. Good. Slag him up. Swap. Bro, that's so easy. Wait, he doesn't have immune phases. Ow. Okay, never mind. We're done. Cool. Yeah, that was normal crawl, though. We need the raid crawl. Huh? Did I drop that? No, that's not mine. When I spammed the North Fleet earlier, maybe like one stray shot went into the back and killed somebody and dropped it. Raid boss crawl. For good old time's sake. Let's take him on. Bro. Dude, take your time. Normally, there's a wall here, right? You can't like run through, but you can go around the wall. Yeah. So, you can kind of use this as the ledge 2.0 for Craw. Kind of funny. But sometimes he can get hit. Not all the time. Oh! Did he buff the loot room in here too? Maybe he did. Legendary Psycho. Legendary Psycho. Huh. Raid boss crawl time. Can we do it? Alright, we don't get kill skills this time, so... Neutral Barbarian. Go. Not bad, not bad. Decent start. Yeah. Hey, there we go. First phase done. And now we can swap over to Reaper, get our kill skills, and melt the boss. Okay, we're fine. Good. Bloodbath. Get that going. Switch. Oh. Good. My goodness. Keep it going. We're not done yet, Chad. It ain't over. Wow. It ain't over yet, though. We still have a little bit more. You're dead. Now we're gonna clear out the arena and check out what we got. So Raid Boss Crawl does drop like actual loot now. Uh, we got a bada boom. Not even like terrible parts on it. I mean, the grip could be matching grip, but that's decent. Another Logan's gun? Wait, another dynamic Logan's gun. Hello? What? Huh? And another legendary psycho. <laughs> See, this feels good. Getting three drops, maybe four for doing what we did here. Overall thoughts on the BL2 fix mod. I like it. I give it a solid 8.5 out of 10. Maybe 9 out of 10. Not a perfect 10 though. I do feel like the end game, like loot throwing at you is a bit much. Like when you kill a raid boss, you get like 10 legendaries or seven legendaries. Um, personally, I think that's a lot, you know? And some of the raid bosses can be killed pretty speedily in this game. I feel like it could be toned down a little bit because I get the feels of the whole BL3 like legendary spam. And if you guys know me, you know I'm not a huge fan of the uh, overbearing amount of legendary thrown at you for endgame. But for the most part, yeah, everything else is great. Like the balancing, the the whole like better chance for prefixes and uh, good grips and whatnot. And just the, the flow of the mod. Rerolling your mission rewards, I freaking love that. That's like one of my favorite things. I'm definitely a huge fan of the mod. Again, it's not going to be part of every run I do in the future, but I will use it maybe for some runs. Yeah, I really like it. Being able to control your OP levels, your actual level cap. It has a lot of good stuff for it, and I'm, I'm really happy with the uh, the way the mod turns out. Before we end the video, I just want to let you guys know that I do stream this on Twitch. You can catch them live from Monday through Friday, 2pm to 6pm CST. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I also hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.